The remains of one time Nigeria's chief of army staff and former military administrator of Plateau State, Major General Mohammed Chris Ali, has been laid to rest at the National Military Cemetery this Wednesday in Abuja with full military honors. Clairview's correspondent was there and now brings us details of the event. <laughs> Adorned in the Nigerian flag of green and white, the body of Nigeria's one-time chief of army staff and former military administrator of Plateau State, Major General Mohammed Chris Ali, was wheeled into the National Military Cemetery Abuja, the final resting place for the senior officer. Present at the event to pay their last respects to the deceased, as the Minister of Defense, Mohamed Badaro Abubakar represented, the Executive Governor of Kogi State, Yaya Bello, Service Chiefs, led by the Chief of Defense Staff, General Christopher Musa, Senior Military Officers and Family Members of the Deceased. You raise the dead to life. Give eternal life to our brother Major General Mohamed Chris Ali. We pray, O oh Lord. The Minister of Defense, Mohamed Badaru Abubakar, who was represented by the Chief of Defense Staff, General Christopher Musa, and the Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Taurid Lagbaja, said the late Army Chief lived a life characterized by service to country and humanity, even in the face of challenges. For Major General Mohamed Chris retired, his transition has elicited marvelous memories of our loving father, brother, uncle, colleague, comrade, and confidant to many nationwide and overseas. The nostalgia in some social cycles equal to his recent glorious passing on has been underscoring his legacy of enviable character, patriotism, love, and service to Nigeria and Nigerians. We cannot but appreciate the Almighty for the life and the good times of this our cherished hero. To this end, we indeed owe him a duty to promote the values that he connected as we entirely pursue national peace, development, and unity for our people. The late General Chris Ali served the Nigerian army, the armed forces of Nigeria, and the nation exceptionally in various capacities, leaving enduring prints on the sands of time. The general mentored and inspired generations who today are mentoring younger generations that did not meet him in service. Earlier at his funeral service, held at the Cathedral of St. Joseph's Catholic Church in Asokoro, Abuja, the choir group ministered in various hymns to set the mood for the event. Thereafter, the officiating priest, Cornell Very Reverend Father Anthony May Magani, in his message, admonished believers to live a life holy and acceptable to God as they await the second coming of Jesus Christ. That is why Jesus tells us, you do not know the day nor the hour when the Son of Man will come. We do not know the day or the hour when we shall what when we shall be called. But if we do not know them and we know that we, we are created by God without our consent, but we cannot be saved by God without our consent. And if you know this, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ, we will always do our best to see that we do what? We will do our best to see that we live holy, noble, and spotless, what? Spotless life. Major General Mohammed Chris Ali was born on 25th December 1944 to parents from Kogi State. 
He served as the 15th Chief of Army Staff from 1993 to 1994 under General Sani Abacha's regime and was military governor of Plateau State, Nigeria from August 1985 to 1986 during the military regime of General Ibrahim Babangida. Many years later, he was appointed interim administrator of the state during a 2004 crisis following ethno-religious killings in Shendam, Yelwa local government area. On 19th November 2023, the late general died at a military hospital in Lagos State following a brief illness. He was aged 78.